you know, as a, I'm a big hunter. I think I think hunting is something you learn. It's kind of a family tradition. You know, you, you learn it when you're a kid. It's something you, you probably keep up and do it when you're an adult. I don't think too many people get into it as, as adults if they weren't exposed to it as a, as kids. Um, you know, I grew up in the country and my father was a big hunter. He uh, you know started me hunting when I was six, seven years old. And uh, I've been doing it ever since. So it's just something I enjoy doing. It's uh, At this point, I think I enjoy being out away from everybody, just having some time to myself more than I, sometimes more than I do actually hunting. Um, you know, uh, everything we, anything, any animal I take, uh, the meat's always consumed. We either donate to the church for the, uh, you know, the outreaches for people that you know need it, or you know I keep it for myself and use that diet on it. You know, I diet on venison and buffalo, um, you know, for the Arnold and the Olympia every year. So uh, you know, I don't believe in uh, you know taking an animal if you're not going to eat it. You know I don't believe in taking something just for sport. So um, that's the way I was taught, and uh, I don't believe in you know destroying a creature just to, for the sake of you know destroying it. So, um, but uh, it's something I love doing. It's a uh, I think you know, if I have a, I'm going to teach my daughter, expose her to it, and hopefully one day I'll have a son and you know, teach him too. I think people are very removed from their food sources. Um, you know, if you've ever been to a slaughterhouse, I have, um, it's much, that's way more cruel than anything I'm out there doing in the, in the field. Um, you know, to see how they treat cattle, you know, sheep, things like that, chickens. Um, you know, it, the, the bottom line for us to live, something has to die. You know, you're either killing a, a plant or an animal. You know, to consume it. You know, it's just the way of life, the circle of life. So um, I think people that grew up in the city, you know, urban environments. Um, you know, I had a friend from New York came down here and uh, we were driving somewhere and, he, and he's like, man, what's that? I'm like, what are you talking about? He's like, that right there in the field. I'm like, that cow? He goes, yeah. He goes, he'd never seen a cow. And I'm like, wow. You know, so um, it's just a totally different frame of reference, you know. I don't think he'd ever been outside the city in his life, obviously. So, um, you know, I think someone like that, they don't understand hunting, they're never exposed to it. They think, oh, you're shooting this furry little, cute little deer, whatever it might be, and uh, they think it's horrible and cruel, but it's uh, actually a lot more humane than, than going to a slaughterhouse and seeing how they treat the animals.